This is the 1940 Packard 180 Super 8 limousine with divider window and jump seats. And the 1940 Packard was a revolution for Packard. This new straight eight, the 356 cubic inch, nine main bearing, counterweighted crankshaft was just the best thing they had ever built up to that point. It was so good that it was able to replace the V12 Packard. V12 Packards are awesome, don't get me wrong, but this is a fantastic engine. 160 horsepower, lots of torque, and it also came available with the overdrive, the factory overdrive, which this car has, and it works. So it is a freeway capable, great driving car. Take a look at a few things. A oh, black plate California car owned by the same family since the 1950s. Uh, the owner remembers driving this car to his high school prom way back in the day. So, um, a great history on it, long term ownership. Um, the paint was done in lacquer um, approximately 1990 by Bill Borzi's shop. Bill was a well-known guy here in Southern California and uh, we're gonna get in it and take it for a drive all right we're gonna fire this 40 Packard up take it for a drive there's the e-brake it does work properly that's nice and we turn the key push the starter button fires right up nice and quiet runs smooth Runs cool, we just put a new radiator in it and uh, that was a thing that worked real good. Um, charges. And we've got a auxiliary mechanical oil gauge because the current one is not reading properly. And uh, there's more gas than empty in there. The gas gauge tries, but it's not registering. So I think it needs a sending unit. But you know what? This car drives so good that it just all of that is irrelevant. Three speed transmission with synchros, it's nice and quiet. Lots of torque, you can move off from standing in second gear if you'd like. Here's another great feature, that red light shows it's ready to go into overdrive, which we do by backing off the throttle and it kicks right in. And uh, we march right up this hill and uh, just takes it with no problem. I love it. of our little mountain and uh, wine colors were going good. Looks like the speedometer could use uh, a repair as well. Stop sign. 